by Donald Trump from the 2024 ballots due to the Capitol riots in 2021. Because of this, there might be an intervention from the U.S. Supreme Court and it could cause chaos for the next election, as well as uncertainty. The bar from Colorado isn't that bad because Colorado is known to be a democratic state. However, Maine is a swing state, so it could potentially be problematic for him. Israel's army chief admits a mission failure after the accidental killing of three Israeli hostages in Gaza, citing preventable errors. Reports found no malice, however, they highlighted the insufficient awareness by the Israeli forces during this operation that took place in December. These hostages were captured by Hamas in October. Actor Lee Sun Kyun, known for his role in Parasite, has died of a suspected suicide amid the police investigation of his alleged drug use. His death contributes to the concerning pattern of deaths and suicides among young actors and celebrities in South Korea, especially young K-pop stars. Despite previous challenges, Huawei has projected a robust 2023 with anticipated revenue surpassing 700 billion yuan or 99 billion dollars, which is marking a 9% increase from 2022. Its new smartphone, the Mate 60 Pro, was a huge success in China, gaining market share and outperforming expectations. SpaceX has launched its X-37B plane, which has made the US military very fascinated. Also, Ukraine's hopes for winning are decreasing since their support from the US is also decreasing. Since 2023 is almost coming to an end, here are some New Year facts for you. Did you know that New Year resolutions date back to ancient Babylon, where the people made promises to the gods at the start of each year? Also, in Spain, it's traditional to eat 12 grapes at the stroke of midnight, symbolizing luck for each month of the year. And the New York famous ball drop was first started in 1907, and it was made of wood and iron, unlike today's dazzling crystal ball. Hi everybody, this week instead of... Hi everybody, this week instead of an APAYC Appear at Your Career segment, we're going to be showing you the highlights of the year 2023. Enjoy! A high altitude balloon, believed to be a Chinese surveillance balloon, is now circling the US. A massive and deadly earthquake hit southeast Turkey near the border that it shares with Syria. And the Earth has now been a year since the war began, and it doesn't seem like it's gonna stop anytime this soon. This has led to protests called the Grey Hair Movement by the older population in China. It's China has banned ChatGPT and are launching an investigation over privacy concerns. Charles III was crowned King of England at Westminster Abbey on Saturday. Russia's Wagner leader will be withdrawing his troops. A Titan submarine that went to explore the Titanic imploded because the lawsuit has been filed against Twitter by a former employee. Alleged the United States of America is going to send a lot of ammunition to Ukraine in a new military aid package. Also, in the past year, global temperatures have soared with unprecedented records. India successfully launched a Thunder in 3 mission. No joke, Hawaii's biggest wildfire ever took 67 lives now and is performing well and is focusing on a rebrand and a new vision. The Vikram Lander and the Pragyan rover have landed on the lunar south pole, making India the first country to ever do so. The BRICS, a group of developing countries, are now expanding after over a decade. The head of the Wagner group, Yerwan Prigozhin, has reportedly been killed. Israel has urged 1.1 million people in Gaza to escape after the recent Hamas attacks. Right now, actors in movies and TV shows in Hollywood are on strike and they're protesting. The SAG AFTRA ends its historic strike with Hollywood after a historic and groundbreaking deal, which Elon Musk faced backlash after endorsing an anti Semitic conspiracy theory on Twitter or X. OpenAI had a significant week with the unveiling of GPT 4 Turbo. Yeah. And the Company's plan is to assess the Paris Agreement 
and reach 1.5 degrees Celsius global warming. Intense fighting and shelling in Gaza has urged Israel to order its residents to move out of city centers and, and Ukraine could be in grave danger if they do not receive more military assistance from the West. Harvard, MIT and UPenn presidents have all received backlash for their vague responses to the genocide calls during an anti-Semitism hearing. 